When we think of a budget electric car, most people imagine something limited, bland, just for the taking. But what if someone said a car costing just 10,975 could go from zero to 60 madipoirampur in approximately six seconds? Sounds like fiction, right? Well, that's exactly what the Model 2 promises to deliver. And the secret to this feat lies in an engine that, despite its small size, is a true performance monster. It's the hypercompact axial flux motor, a technology that until recently was only seen in racing supercars and experimental projects. But now, almost unbelievably, this innovation is about to hit the streets in an entry-level car. This axial flux motor delivers 200 horsepower, and we're not talking about uncontrolled brute force. It's 20% smaller than the Model 3's motor, but incredibly more efficient. With 94% energy efficiency, it easily outperforms models like the Nissan Leaf Plus and even the Hyundai Ioniq 5 in terms of efficiency. This means that virtually all of the battery's energy is converted into motion without waste. And when it comes to electric cars, this efficiency rate changes everything, as it directly affects cost of ownership, range, and driving experience. The difference that 15% less engine weight makes in practice is more noticeable than you might think. Less weight means quicker cornering, smoother acceleration, and greater control in urban maneuvers. The driver feels the car is lighter, more lively, and more responsive. And it doesn't stop there. This lightness also positively impacts overall fuel efficiency. It's as if the car is always one step ahead, anticipating what the driver wants to do before they even realize it. And most interestingly, this agility didn't come with compromises in quality or reduced comfort. The trade-off between performance and cost also can't be ignored. A car with these specs would normally cost three times as much, and that's precisely what's grating on the nerves of traditional automakers. After all, how can you justify pricing vehicles at $30,000 or $40,000 when a smaller, faster, and more efficient Tesla is starting to appear for a third of that? The Model 2 isn't just competing with the most expensive electric cars. It's humiliating them all in metrics that truly matter to the end consumer. Furthermore, this incredible efficiency translates into real savings. With 94% efficiency, the Model 2 can save about $450 per year on recharging alone compared to models that run at 88% efficiency. And that's not counting indirect savings, such as reduced engine wear, reduced maintenance, and less time spent at charging stations. Drivers feel the impact of this intelligent engineering which combines power and intelligence in a minimal space, in their pockets, and over time. And perhaps most surprising of all is that this technology isn't being sold as something exclusive or elitist. On the contrary, the Model 2's axial flux engine is a clear commitment to democratizing performance, bringing high-end features to an audience that never imagined having access to this kind of experience. And this paves the way for a new type of consumer, one who no longer wants to choose between price and quality. They want both. And now, finally, it seems they can have it. What immediately catches your eye when you look at the Model 2 are the wheels. But it's not just about aesthetics or size. They really think. Literally, the 19-inch Smart Aero wheels are much more than just a pretty accessory. They're a vital part of the car's performance and intelligence. Controlled by artificial intelligence, they adjust small built-in fins in real time, every 0.1 seconds, to improve aerodynamics. This means that, even without the driver realizing it, the car is constantly adapting to wind, speed, and road conditions to save energy and gain more range. This continuous adjustment reduces aerodynamic drag by up to 15% a significant figure when it comes to electric cars. For the user, this translates into about 40 kilometers of extra range per charge, a bonus that can be decisive for many. And what makes this magic possible is a bold combination of precision engineering with sensors 
and algorithms that communicate directly with the car's central system. Unlike traditional wheels, which are completely static, these are always working, even when everything appears normal from the outside. But the innovation goes beyond aerodynamics. The wheel structure is also revolutionary. They're made from a recycled carbon composite, which not only reduces emissions during production, but also makes each wheel 18% lighter than conventional wheels. This reduces so-called unsprung weight, the weight that directly affects suspension and steering behavior. The result? A car that's more agile around corners, with faster acceleration and much more control in the driver's hands. Every detail was designed to make driving more efficient, lighter, and safer. Safety, by the way, is another area where these wheels truly excel. Built-in sensors monitor tire pressure, rubber wear, and even ground grip in real time. All of this is sent to the car's dashboard, connecting directly to the Starlink system. Drivers know exactly what's happening with their tires without having to get out of the car or rely solely on luck. What's more, this technology reduces the risk of high-speed blowouts by up to 35% and improves braking by 10% on wet roads. These are data points that make a real-life difference, especially in unexpected situations. Another interesting fact is that these wheels are customizable. With electrochromic coatings, drivers can change the color directly from the car's dashboard, a first in this price range. Seven styles are available at launch, allowing users to change the look to suit their mood or occasion. And unlike premium brands that charge a premium for this feature, on the Model 2, this feature starts at just $300. Besides adding a touch of style, this customization increases resale value by up to 5% as the car appeals to both performance and visual identity seekers. Not everyone buys a car with drag racing or color-changing wheels in mind. For many, what really matters is whether the car will be practical for everyday use, whether it will hold groceries, whether it will handle weekend trips with the family, or whether it will make parking easier on a tight street. And that's where the Model 2 shines in a unique way. It was designed with this exact audience in mind, those who value practicality over spec sheet numbers. And its performance in this regard is as impressive as its technical performance. The modular interior, for example, is a real coup. With fold-flat rear seats and adjustable cargo panels, the Model 2 offers up to 1330 liters of usable trunk space. That's 20% more than the BYD Seagull, which is considered a benchmark among compact cars. In practice, you can easily carry suitcases, strollers, backpacks, large groceries, or even a folded bicycle. The interior layout was designed to adapt to the daily routine of those who need versatility, not just cute seats. Now comes one of the most intelligent aspects of the project, integration with the Starlink connectivity system. This makes the Model 2 not just an electric car, but a true personal assistant. It syncs with the user's schedule, suggests the best departure times based on real-time traffic, preheats or pre-cools the cabin before you get in, and even points to the nearest charging station. This isn't just comfort, it's time-saving. With this type of automation alone, it's estimated that the driver can regain about 15 minutes of time per day. It doesn't seem like much, but in a year, that adds up to over 90 hours. Another factor that influences many drivers' purchasing decisions is maintenance costs. In this regard, the Model 2 blows its competitors away. Thanks to the Graphene Fusion battery, which promises over 2,000 full charge cycles, around 20 years of regular use, the battery's durability is enormous. And with no combustion engine, there are no complicated oil changes, spark plugs, belts, or filters. Annual maintenance costs are estimated to be around $200, a fraction of what you'd spend on a gasoline-powered car. And when you add that to the fuel savings, the savings are immediate. Urban handling has also been optimized. The Model 2 is about 10% smaller than the Model 3, which provides greater agility on narrow streets and in tight parking spaces. 
But the reduced size doesn't mean a loss of features. Quite the opposite. The car features a comprehensive parking assistance system with 360-degree vision and intelligent obstacle detection. Cameras and sensors work together to reduce the difficulty of parking in small spaces by up to 50%, something many drivers face daily and which causes headaches even in more expensive models. Putting a car like this on the road for less than $11,000 seems like a joke. But the Model 2 didn't reach this price point by magic or quality cuts. What's behind it is a meticulously thought-out production strategy that combines cutting-edge engineering with absurd industrial scale. The key to all this lies in a technology called gigacasting, which is nothing more than the casting of large parts of the car into a single piece. Instead of assembling the chassis from dozens of smaller parts, Tesla has started creating entire structures in a single foundry, which drastically reduces assembly time and cost. This industrial paradigm shift allows for savings of up to 50% in production costs, especially in the vehicle's structural parts. The process also reduces the margin of error, improves durability, and facilitates automation. And it's not just about cutting costs. By producing faster and with fewer parts, Tesla gains a massive advantage over its competitors who still operate with traditional assembly models, which are much more expensive and slower. This creates a unique window of opportunity to bring cars like the Model 2 to market at seemingly impossible prices. But the strategy goes beyond the factory. Tesla has near complete control of the production chain, from batteries to software, assembly, logistics, and even control chips. This means the company relies less on external suppliers, resulting in greater agility, fewer interruptions, and more freedom to test new solutions. This allows Model 2 production to be scaled more easily, serving different markets with minimal adaptations. Standardization and vertical integration ensure that every penny invested goes further without compromising final quality. And this scale is no small feat. The goal is to produce up to 3 million units per year by 2028, combining the capacities of the Texas and Shanghai factories. This number surpasses the current production volume of many traditional automakers. And this completely changes the market dynamics. It's no longer a niche or experimental vehicle. The Model 2 is designed to be the electric car of the masses, the kind of vehicle that will fill parking spaces at grocery stores, schools, gas stations, and buildings everywhere. A car that will no longer be the exception, but the rule. In the United States, this strategy is boosted by a decisive factor, tax credits. With federal incentives of up to $7,500, the Model 2's final price can drop to less than $4,000 in some states. That's less than many high-powered motorcycles. And unlike other brands that try to compete on price, Tesla manages to keep the price low without compromising on engine, finish, or technology. It's an advantage few can replicate because it requires a combination of its own factory, proprietary software, materials control, and fine-tuned logistics. And when you put all this together, gigacasting, total production control, tax incentives, and a focus on volume, the landscape begins to change rapidly. The Model 2 goes from being a distant promise to a real threat. It represents a new kind of car, produced differently, with a pricing logic completely outside the old norms. And if there's one thing the automotive market has learned in recent years, it's that when Tesla changes the game, others have to race to catch up. And this time, the distance may be too far for those still stuck in the old mold. This new scenario, with an efficient, affordable electric car produced on a massive scale, raises an inevitable question. What will happen to Chinese automakers, which currently dominate the global entry-level electric car market? For years, companies like BYD have occupied this space by offering affordable models, mass-produced and exported worldwide. But now, 
With the Model 2 entering the game with a price tag up to $7,000 below the average for Chinese exported EVs, this lead is beginning to shake. And it's not just because of the price, it's because of the combination of range, technology, and brand trust. The perceived difference in quality already puts consumers at a crossroads. While many Chinese EVs still face suspicion regarding durability and technical support outside of China, the Model 2 arrives with a solid reputation and a global after-sales structure. And when you add this to the fact that the car offers greater range, more connectivity, satellite updates, and an already established digital ecosystem, the balance begins to tip dangerously in Tesla's favor. The cost advantage that Chinese brands had is slowly being eroded. The numbers projected by analysts are clear. If Tesla can maintain its Model 2 production and distribution pace, it could capture up to 30% of the Chinese entry-level electric vehicle market by 2029, a territory that, until recently, was considered inaccessible to any foreign brand. And what's most impressive is that this advance is happening even though Tesla is seen as an American company, at a time when economic protectionism is on the rise. This shows that when the product is good and the price is fair, even geopolitical barriers lose their power. Another critical point is the impact of brand image. Tesla maintains a 90% satisfaction rate among its customers, while brands like BYD, even with accelerated growth, hover around 65%. This difference is stark when it comes to loyalty. Satisfied customers don't just return to buy. They recommend, advocate, and build communities around the brand. And in today's digital world, this is as valuable as a multi-million dollar marketing campaign. Tesla is positioning itself as more than just an automaker. It sells innovation, lifestyle, and, for many, a piece of Elon Musk's futuristic vision. There's also the advantage of being off the radar of certain restrictions. With rising trade tensions between China and Western countries, especially the US and Europe, Chinese cars could face tariffs, bans, or consumer distrust. The Model 2, manufactured in Texas and expanding in Shanghai, can operate on both sides with greater flexibility. This makes it a sort of neutral corridor amid the dispute, enjoying the best of both worlds, while other models face logistical and political obstacles. And it's at this point that the end of China narrative in the affordable electric car sector begins to take shape. It's not a collapse, but a shift in prominence. Tesla is rewriting the rules of the game, transforming what was once a competition between major automakers into a race for efficiency, price, and production intelligence. And those who don't keep up, whether in the West or the East, will end up falling behind. Starting with the Model 2, the center of gravity of the electric revolution begins to shift, and everything indicates there's no stopping this shift. 